Hey guys, what's up? Pasay Baller here. We are now in this third game for today, January 18, 2023. So we now have uh, this matchup between Charlotte Hornets and Houston Rockets that will happen around 8 o'clock p.m. Eastern Time. So that is going to be 9 o'clock a.m. here in Manila. I'm just inviting everyone who have not subscribed yet to our YouTube account or YouTube channel, Pase Baller. Please click on the subscribe button below. At the same time, hit on that bell logo. That way, automatically, you guys will be receiving notifications whenever new videos are uploaded. The spread, by the way, that is given, it's minus 2. And that's actually given towards the visiting team, the Charlotte Hornets. Now, let's check on the standings and the rankings of both teams first, okay? Well, this is going to be interesting and crazy because uh, both teams... Um, are actually the bottom or uh, the dead last uh, team for both conferences. Starting with Houston Rockets, they are at number 15, just like what I said, with the record of 10 wins and 34 losses. For Charlotte Hornets, um, they are number 15 again, but this time it's in the Eastern Conference with a record of 11 wins and 34 losses. So half a game just separates um, these, uh, these two teams, all right? Again, this is going to be an interesting matchup. So, Houston Rockets will have uh, the home court advantage on this. In terms of fatigue, well, both teams have uh, rested last night, so we can skip that part. In terms of uh, in terms of momentum, man, uh, it's going to be crazy because uh, both teams are having uh, losing streaks coming onto this game, losing slumps, whatever you want to call them. Um, Charlotte Hornets, they are in a five-game losing slump, but man, Houston Rockets, they are on an 11-game uh 11 game drought winning drought so 11 game losing slump versus five game losing slump let's see which will actually stop after this game so if you take a look at the availability of the players okay now for uh houston rockets we have kevin porter jr listed as questionable in here for uh, charlotte hornets kelly Oubre out and we have both gordon hayward and cody martin uh listed as questionable um, so, I would uh, I would have to say that Houston Rockets would have a slight advantage in here, um, having just one player listed as questionable as compared to uh, Hornets, wherein one is already confirmed out, and that's Ubre, and we all know Ubre brings a lot to the to the table, and then there are a couple of other players who are listed questionable. Okay, here we go. So, this is gonna be crazy because again, both teams are the worst teams on both East and the West, okay? Um, uh, <laughs> it's, it's, this, one's, this one's crazy, but I want to watch this game, to be honest. Uh, I, don't, I just want to see what's going to happen. But if you take a look at the starting five of both, you know, of both teams, they're actually good. You know, they are actually good. They're, 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 there is talent right there. There is size. It's just that, you know, um, th their bench is, you know, there's no depth in the bench. That's what I'm trying to say. Um, if only they would have great support off the bench, then you know it wouldn't be this bad for you know for any of these two teams. Um, plus the experience, um, experience they actually need that, and going through uh, these losing you know losing slumps actually teach them a lot. I'm pretty sure. I'm pretty sure about that. But for this matchup, as to who's going to win, it's almost, it, it is a toss coin, to be honest. There's not like a scientific explanation for this one, man. But I'm going to consider the fact that, number one, Houston Rockets is at home. Number two, Houston Rockets is the healthier team, having just one player uh, listed in the injury list. For Charlotte, there are three. And number and then number three, Houston Rockets would have the plus two on it. So I don't know. Maybe this one will be a close game. I don't know. But again, I'm considering all those factors. They are at home. They are the healthier team. Um, uh, I would I would also have to say that um, they are the hungrier team on this. You know, they are there. There's more dignity and pride on the line. Especially they are playing um, in front of their home crowd. Um, I'm not actually discarding Charlotte Hornets though because I love Lamelo Ball. You know, Lamelo Ball is a very talented uh, individual. Um, again, he uh, he just needs uh, people around him, you know, to to help him out. But in this particular match out uh, matchup, I guess uh, Houston Rockets. I'm gonna pick Houston Rockets with a plus two on it. Uh, you know, to be a bit safe, but I'm not gonna be surprised if Houston Rockets would actually win this one outright and put a slump on that 11 game losing slump. But again, just to be safe, I'm gonna take Houston Rockets with a plus two on it. Again, my take would be Houston plus two. Peace out, passe love, and God bless.